Yes, and I want to tell you, those girls have three and four babies apiece. That is a terrible, terrible thing. And started dating boys in the block. They spending the night every illegal thing in the world going on under Miss Teresa's roof. But they got control of Miss Teresa. Miss Teresa is the babysitter. She says she got 19 grandchildren, and I never seen anything like it in my life. So, anyway, four and five babies apiece in their 20s. They ain't working nowhere. They out running the street, partying, stick the grandmama with the baby. Something need to be done. Something need to be done. The yarn have looked like crap since they moved here. I told them, I said, if you're going to live cross in front of me, you're going to have to use a rake and keep the yarn clean. But I'm telling you, they're drinking. I guess it might be one of her sons that come over there and drink and throw the damn cans down the malt lager. They be out of control. The police have been there at least four times since they've been there from the fighting amongst themselves, fighting with other people. It is horrible. And these people need to be made to leave. They don't need to be in a neighborhood where people are buying their homes. They are buying absolutely nothing. They don't give a damn about nothing, throw food out the house. On the side of the house, I told Miss Teresa, when I saw her daughter doing it, I say, it's rats. It's possums. You don't throw that out on the side of the house. You put that in a trash can. These ghetto people got to go. It's too many of them. The neighborhood ain't worth $50 with them things in it, and they all over. And I will show you more of it. Later on, over and out, Teddy.